So I did some damage. How you doing, young lady? The feeling that you're giving really drives me crazy. You don't have a play about the choke. I was at a loss of words first time that we spoke. You're looking for a girl that'll treat you right. Good morning, you guys, and welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new. My name's Nicole, and I post videos on here every Thursday and Sunday. And today, I am just beaming with excitement. I truly have not had such a lovely morning <laughs> in the longest time. So essentially, just for a little bit of a backstory, I recently graduated from nursing school back in like end of April. So that really took a lot out of me. I was studying every day. I was working also and then I quit working just to solely study and it finally paid off. I just heard the news this morning at about like 5 30 that I passed the exam and I'm officially an RN. I am so excited. So I just wanted to bring you guys along with me for the day and right now I'm just gonna take my parents and I out for breakfast just to celebrate. So without further ado let's go right ahead. For a little outfit of the Today, I'm just wearing some airy flare leggings, this root sweater, and just my purse. now breakfast was so good i'm very very full but i need to buy a lunch bag for work and then i also think today at some point i might order some new shoes just because i really need some waterproof shoes ideally i was thinking either hokas or vessies just for work because you never know like liquids can fall at all times and i just want my shoes to be waterproof if possible we're gonna look into that and then i also need to edit and stuff today but i'm just gonna bring you guys along for the day so i will see you guys at winners all right you guys we are now at winners we had no luck in the other place for lunch bags so we're just gonna check here and hopefully we have some luck Also had no luck in the winter so here we are at Marshall's if I find nothing here we're going home home i'm honestly exhausted but essentially i went to two winners one marshall's no lunch bag everything that they had was kind of ugly in all honesty so i still need a lunch bag but i'm sure i will find one eventually i might check amazon they might have some cute ones my boyfriend's sister she has a dog named dolly and she's the cutest thing ever and i am in love with her and she is a dash hound so my mom found this in winners and i had to i had to get it this is her just slightly different color i also want a dash hound now so yeah i got her and then i also got these black platform ugg lookalikes they're the brand cushionaire but i got these for pat's other sister caroline i know she likes a platform so when i saw that they had platform i just gave her a text and facetimed her she liked them so i got them for her but apart from that that is quite literally all i got today i'm honestly in no rush to get a lunch bag like i can just use like a lululemon bag for the time being and then when i find a lunch bag i like then i'll order that but now that we're on the topic of like boots and stuff i actually got some uggs that i really want to show you guys so i did some damage <laughs> quite a bit of damage but i don't really treat myself too often so this was a nice big splurge and i won't really treat myself to anything for a good while now i got the classic mini not the ultra mini i don't really like the ultra mini personally but i just got these uggs i think they're so cute i love the light wash of them they just have the logo right there little strap the fur is nice and fluffy you just have the nice sole of the foot yeah i think this is super cute i'm always wearing black so i figured wearing this with like leggings and then get a new coat just like a kind of like shearling type jacket i think would be adorable very expensive but 
that is okay. I deserve it, especially with this news. Um, obviously I bought those beforehand, but I was really, really, really banking on me passing this exam. I am just so happy. Today is such a fun day and I'm just so, so grateful for everything. Now I need to send some emails for YouTube, just like potential collabs and stuff. I also have some work emails to send. I also need to pack just because I am going to my boyfriend's cottage this weekend for Thanksgiving and we leave tomorrow morning. I'm heading up with a sister and her boyfriend. So I don't know when I'm going to go to the grocery store. I might go tomorrow just because I don't think we have freezer space for pizza. I might just go tomorrow. That way I don't need to put it in my own freezer because I genuinely do not think I have any space. But yeah, so I'm going to send some emails and stuff and then we'll catch up in a little bit and go from there. Hold inside, we're too close to show. It is so much later. I easily spent at least an hour, if not two, just sending emails, getting stuff figured out. I placed an order for new glasses just because I want a work pair of glasses. That way I have my work pair, I have a backup pair in my work bag, and then I also have one pair at home. That way if a kid... Oh, by the way, I'm going to be working at a children's hospital, which I am so, so excited about. I'm just so grateful. I cannot wait to just brighten up their days. I know it's tough being in the hospital, so if I can be a little glimmer of sunshine for them I will always try and do my best and just provide the best care for them but yes essentially I am going to be working at a children's hospital and for work I also ordered a pair of shoes just because I needed a pair of shoes solely for work ideally waterproof my mom has a pair of Vessies they're unreal so comfy so I figured why not order a pair of Vessies being a nurse you can get literally anything on your shoes let alone scrubs so I just figured having a separate pair of glasses in case a kid like smacks me in the head breaks my glasses or something you never know so i'm just preparing that way i always have a backup i'm gonna have backup scrubs backup glasses the shoes are waterproof i ordered a black pair from bessie and i'm just so excited i feel like i'm slowly getting ready i also didn't even show you actually so one of my best friends mz she got me this work bag this is the bag i have it filled completely with the storage containers that dilsey got me i also recently went to winners and i bought myself a thermos so this was $20 and I figured I could take this put some soup in there or if I feel like some chicken nuggets I can just easily put it in here and it stays warm 16 hours cold 10 hours hot so my shifts are 12 hours regardless it'll stay warm or cold which is amazing being a nurse in a pediatric hospital I definitely want to incorporate fun colors I bought some pink scrubs I'll show you really quick I bought this pair of pink scrubs I just think this is so cute and fun if my nurse came in with a pair of hot pink scrubs that would make my day and I actually have have one friend working in an adjacent unit like literally right beside and I'm so excited so I asked her she confirmed that I could get the shoes because I wasn't sure about like policy on like color of shoes or the strictness on the material or anything but I got the green light I ordered them I'm so excited along with the bag my this was actually part of my birthday gift my friend Unzi again she always gets me like the most thoughtful gifts she got me a bunch of badge reels so I just have my badge on here so I can't really show you guys but I have this little pill one and and this one is the one that I'm going to be using first. I just think it is so cute. And I also got these cards. This is just like a pediatrics card that has like regular vitals. And it also has your APGAR score, some med calculations for peds. You do need to calculate meds just because everything goes with their weight. And then I also just have conversions on the back here. And then she got me like a pack of like various badge reels. So I also have this one. It is a cute little brain. I cannot. I live for this stuff. She also also got me one it's like a cute little checklist so I'm gonna be switching it up literally every single week I love this one a little EKG on there little pair of lungs you have a heart with a little smile a cute little band-aid I love this one and then last but not least this needle which I think is so cute as well I'm going to be rotating through these so much and see if you're watching thank you so much I love this she also got me this really funny nurse mug has the nutrition facts for a nurse she said she wanted to customize it but unfortunately that wasn't an option it came with oh my god you're joking right sorry i found a spider in the mug 
because I left it open and with the weather and everything, there's been a lot of spiders lately. I'm gonna have to clean it out again because it's like fully still alive in there, but I'm home alone at this very moment. So that will be something for my parents to deal with. I shoved some tissue paper inside that way it can't get out. Once I kill the spider, it's gonna be amazing. I don't know if you guys can see it. Ugh, it's like fully in there. Do you see it? Oh, gross. But yeah, I just trapped it by shoving some tissue paper in there. But yeah, I think that was about it. And if you guys want an in-depth what's in my nursing bag, let me know because I would love to make one. I'm just so excited for this next chapter in my life. I'm going to have to start looking to buy a car within the next like month at the very latest, just because I have to commute and I don't have my own car. So I need to work around that. That way I don't take my parents. I think it's time that I get my own car. I just am not ready for that mentally financially <laughs> i'm just baby steps baby steps it's about 2 30 almost three o'clock and i'm getting a bit hungry so i'm gonna eat my leftover crepe and that will be my lunch and yeah it has been a very very productive overwhelming but just such a perfect day and i'm gonna be popping by pat's later just because i have to get the keys for the cottage and we still need to pack but we'll do that after lunch all right you guys i have half of my crepe left and i'm just going to eat it and watch some Netflix, I think. Alrighty, so it's a little bit later. I ate and stuff, got the spider out of my mug. I washed it and now we are just going to pack for the cottage. So I'm currently watching The Parent Trap on my iPad. So I'll just do a little time lapse and show you once I'm all packed. It honestly didn't take very long just because we're there for three days, like not even. I'm leaving tomorrow morning around 11 and then we're coming back Sunday around lunchtime, I want to say. I am just going to finish watching The Parent Trap. I think I have like maybe a half hour left in the movie and I think it'll be dinner time. My brother's coming over for dinner. He recently moved out in the summer, so yeah, it'll be nice to have him over for dinner and yeah, I will catch up with you guys in a little bit once the movie's done. All right, you guys, I'm just going to drive over to Pat's and pick up his cottage key and then we'll come back home and eat some dinner. I am starving, so let's get the show on the road. It's about six o'clock. We are definitely trying out a new angle right here, but um, I just kind of wanted to update you. So I went and got the keys from my boyfriend's place. My face is like so gross right now just because I've had makeup on all day. I am itching to take it off, so I'm just doing that now. I then ate dinner. My brother was supposed to pop over actually, but I don't really know what, but essentially he's with his girlfriend now, so I don't know if he's coming over anymore or like maybe he'll come over later. But yeah, so we just ate dinner, my parents and I. And then right after dinner, I put together this little like fruit thing with some strawberries and grapes just for me to bring up to the cottage and then just like have some fruit if I feel like it for like lunch lunch or a snack or something and then I also wanted to show you some makeup so a brand called OG they're like an organic makeup brand literally the best products I tried them out for the first time they sent over this vitamin C elixir love that they also sent over this face stick which is like my perfect shade I love it everything is also magnetic this is a contour stick I then have a blush, a highlight, which is still a general like blush shade. And then they also sent over makeup brush, which is so smooth at applying my makeup. And then they also sent this brush, which is more like a tapered kind of like eyeshadow concealer brush, if you will. Oh, and actually while we're talking about makeup, I have some clips from another makeup brand that sent me stuff, Merit Beauty, that I never posted. So I'm actually just gonna insert it right now. Hello you guys, so I know this technically is not part of a vlog, but I got a package in the mail. It is from Merit Beauty. So they sent over their signature bag that is free with every single purchase. It's just like a cute little 
kind of like hobo bag and then you just untie it like that and then you can have all your makeup inside and then you can tie it again and just take it on the go with you. They let me pick out the items that I wanted. So I first chose the Flush Bomb Cheek Color and this is in the color Cheeky. So already beautiful packaging. I love how compact it is. You can really take it for any trips that you go on. Just twist it off and then you have the blush there and then the lid is just transparent. I don't think there's a distinct odor. And then the second product that I chose is the Merit the Minimalist Perfecting Complexion Stick. And this is in the shade Cam. So this is essentially like an all-in-one face stick. You can use it as foundation, concealer. So here we just have the stick and you can open it right up. So I do have some moisturizer on already. So I think I'm honestly just going to apply this to my under eye. Oh my god, that this is going to be my new favorite product. I already can tell. Yes. Has smile lines a little bit on my cheek on my forehead and then just in some spots where I have a few minor blemishes already. I just feel like it's like so seamless. So I'm just gonna take a buffing brush. This is just buffing brush. I think, I don't even know where it's from, but I'm just gonna blend this in. But the brush that they have looked phenomenal. So I must say it's blending in quite nicely. And then we're just gonna blend in under the eye. And this doubles as kind of like a foundation, yet a concealer. Now for the blush, we're just going to apply it on my cheeks. I think I'm just gonna go in with this kind of buffing brush as well. So I'm just going to blend that out with my brush. I really like this blush. So I definitely love that this is one, buildable, two, it blends out so nicely. And three, it just gives you like a really nice kind of sheen to your face. Thank you so much, Merit Beauty. And we're back. I genuinely, am obsessed with those products so I'm like still currently editing the content that I made for them but that will be going up on TikTok and on Instagram. I'm also just so excited now that I'm just going to be working and don't have to study. I can have days off where I fully just have a day off and I can film all day, all night, all weekend if I want. I can reach out to brands more. I'm just so excited. Anyways, I think I'm actually going to end off the video here just because I am going to get in bed now. I've had a very, very early morning, so I'm going to get to bed in a little bit, but I really do hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much if you stuck around for the entire video. It really means a lot to me and also getting to share this very special exciting day with you guys as well that just makes my heart warm so thank you very much from the bottom of my heart your newest rn which is crazy to say but i could not be more grateful or excited to start my work i'm so excited but also so scared for life but yeah if you guys enjoyed the video please forget to give it a big old thumbs up subscribe and turn on my post notifications so you guys never miss any uploads and as always i will see you guys in the next one you're looking for a girl that'll treat you right if you're looking for in the daytime with a light you might be the type if i play my cards right i'll find out by the end of the night you expect me to just let you hit it but will you still respect me if you get it all i can do is try give me one change